This video shows two new methods in the dialog component um, for use in a repeating section. So you can see here that I've got a repeating section and I'm going to go there and uh, fill in some values. Uh, 1, 2, 3, Main Street, uh, Boston, Mass. And then I'm going to click the uh, duplicate button and you can see there that we've uh, duplicated that row and uh, we put it in the first available non-dirty row. So if we were to go back now and do this again and I'll go here and I'll type billing 123 Main Street Boston and then go here and make that row dirty and then ma make that row dirty then you can see now when I click the duplicate since there are no rows that are not currently dirty we're going to automatically go and add a new row to the repeating section where we put that duplicate uh, value over there now to see how that was actually done we just go back to uh, design mode and then go look at this button that says duplicate and you can see here that we've gone to text mode and we've used the duplicate repeating section row method and if I were to simply go there and type in DUP you can see there is the uh, helper that brings up the, um, the method the duplicate repeating row method and uh, also you can see here that we've passed in container 2 which is the ID of the repeating section which I can get there by going over there to the repeating section and looking at the ID of the repeating section. So in addition to, um, to uh, this uh, duplicate uh, method here we also have an, another method called copy row. So let's go take a look now at the syntax on copy row here and you can see here that copy row uh, has the same container ID and then it has a source row number and then a target row number and then uh, true or false uh, which um, means uh, either s prompt if you're going to overwrite existing data or suppress the prompt so let's uh, remove that completely so we just use the default which is true and then minus one means use whatever the current row with focus is as the target row. So what this means right now is copy whatever data is in row 1 to the row that currently has focus. So let's go here and uh, save this and then I'm going to go there and uh, type in 1, 2, 3 uh, main street and then give focus to row 2 and then click the button and you can see that we've copied the data to the current row. Now I'm going to go here and um, click the button. Now in this case row 3 is dirty so we get the prompt um, override existing data in row and if I say OK then we're going to override the data. So um, these two new methods that are available in the dialog component uh, will make it easier to, uh, during data entry to duplicate rows in, the, uh, uh, in an existing repeating section. Thank you very much.